Right, I have in the studio right now, I have the band that won Kiss Got Talent 2013. We did the competition at O'Shea's on Friday night, where we had uh, four singers. Well, I'll say three singers in a group. Two singers, two groups? Yeah. And well, the winners are here in the studio with me. They're a Portuguese band by the name of Blast the Mask. So, good morning. Hola, bon dia. Bon dia. Good morning. morning. How are you feeling today? You all right? Have you come down yet from the clouds? Yeah. You seem, I've got to be honest, you did seem quite happy when you'd won. Yeah, yeah. It's always we're, a surprise, but it, yeah. Well, it's because it's we had, we've just been talking then, we had four completely different singers. We had a young guy who was singing songs people know. Yeah. We had uh, the opera singer. Yeah. We had a Portuguese duet. And then we have you guys. Now, the difference between you guys was you were doing your own music. You were doing stuff that you'd written and produced yourself. Yeah. So, therefore, the crowd didn't know it. That's yeah. right. And they still voted you through. So, it must have been... I mean, as, as, I mean, I thought you were very good. I mean, the with your third song, what was your third song? What was that one called? Someone Tonight. Someone Tonight. I yes. found myself, uh, along with other people that were talking about, I was humming that song yeah. <laughs> halfway through and I don't know it. Does that make sense? Yeah, that's... A little bit, yes. That's a little bit commercial. That's what you call it. Commercial. Well, you've it's got, sort of got a funny... It's got, it's got this... I mean, he was it's some sort of... Yeah. In the middle yeah. of it. And yeah. you, you were a singer as well. Yeah, well, that, that's what I found out. I was doing that halfway through and I didn't know the <laughs> didn't record. didn't have enough micro to do the, the second yeah. voice. Well, no, I just started <laughs> joining in. It was good, actually. I mean, and, and the thing is, if you're doing that halfway through a song that you don't know, Technically, the song must be pretty. You've got to think in your head. The song must be pretty good. You probably don't see it like that because it's your no. song. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. 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 But if, if I mean, was that that's what your one of your more commercial ones? You say exactly. Yeah. And who wrote that? Because you, like you say, you write your own stuff. Who wrote that one? Mauro. It started with this guy. So you're you're not you're not, the one you're not Portuguese. I'm guessing place. from your accent. Yeah, I'm Italian. Italian. All right, you see the Italian stallion. You've got to have one Italian stallion in the group, haven't you? So you're you're, you're all Portuguese <laughs> apart from the Italian stallion. Yeah. 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 Well, I'm the black sheep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he doesn't like me, does he? Be honest, come on, he doesn't like me at all. No gosh, no. He doesn't understand. He's not understanding. No gosh, no. Never look his face. Is no, he has just slept two hours yesterday. That's the reason. Welcome to my world, but I'm happy in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> so, got the listen. So, um, you, how long have you been together? Months. So you've only been playing together for 10 months as a band? Yeah. Well, the initial band started earlier. Uh, it was around, the first members, it was around maybe April, April, May. Of so uh, this year? No, uh, 2012. Okay, so again, even the first members, so the actual band Blast the Mask, before you change to this setup now, it's, no. you've not been together years and years, have you? A couple no, of years? No, no, no. started with me and both Yazus, uh, and then you just. And then we just started getting more people and we decided to the date off all the band together to be around 10 months before, so... I mean, so that's not bad. So you've only been writing your own music as as Blast the Mask, you guys, for yes. 10 months. Yes. To come up with stuff like, like you came up with to win, basically, which is really cool. Yeah. Yes. With, um, what I found strange, a little bit strange on Friday, was an... Only because when you see a band, usually a band is the drums, it's a lead guitar, a bass guitar, and a singer. That's a band. But you have two sort of lead guitars. You have, do you have yes? Is it two lead or do you have a rhythm and a lead? Yeah. It's, just, it's like in terms, you know? It's like they match one, uh, one each other. Yeah. Well, Andy, yeah, because you, you did a little solo and then you broke into a little solo. On the on the guitars, um, um, who plays the bass? Are you, you, it's me. Oh. And the guitar, is the, the second guitar. Uh, the guitar or, yeah. what, what we mean is there is no lead guitar or or main guitar. Yeah, it's but just uh, they constantly blend. Yeah, it's just blended, how, how we feel know? in the songs. We just start jamming, and the song come out like it's just how we feel in the song. Because it's good to do that. You see what you do there. Because obviously, if if money becomes tight and and you've got no money, you can just get rid of one of your guitar players. Because you've got another one. It's great. Yeah. You just Sack him, can you still get him? <laughs> if you had to sack one of them, which one would you get rid of? The Italian stallion or Tiago? Oh, I would be the first out, I, I guess. <laughs> you would, why, last in, first out, is that what, is that what it was? Uh, no. So listen, uh, you're, the, you're, the, you're, the, you're the lead singer, are you yeah. the only singer? Do, do any of the other guys sing? 
Well, we tried to put Andre into the yeah, back yeah, vocals yeah. and Maru, but it's um, um, sorry to say, you've got to sing. Well, you've got to start doing. One of you's got to start doing the harmonies and stuff like that. One of you got to do that because you can't do it all on your own. Yeah, I know. We have to try. Uh, yeah. All of three hard. of us have to try. It's very hard for me to uh, teach singing because you know it's it's in it's within you. You have or you learn. It's very very life. hard. Yes. It's very hard. Or you sing. If you can't and it's sing. It's hard for me to tell them. Oh, that's that's horrifying. <laughs> oh, horrifying. Is it that bad? <laughs> yeah, sometimes. We didn't, she, she's telling us. We didn't even go for not very good. We went straight to horrifying. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. That's why we, we like, missed that. We just go down. We like her <laughs> honesty. That's why. No, really. I have to. I have to. Otherwise, we would be. This is. I like to do things really. I'm really strict with me myself and. I go with those guys as well because I go, I just hit them on the face as well sometimes so. because I really want this to be perfect. So on Friday, listen, on Friday, um, what, what I found was quite good, and this is uh, this is the beauty of this competition, okay? Mm. Because we wanted people to enter that have, have never entered this competition before, that, that basically stood a chance to win. And the funny thing was that you were working Friday and you couldn't get the night off. <laughs> so he had to run down and get you. Yeah. Ten minutes before he came on, he had to come and get you. Yeah, I had to close the door to go to the toilets. Normally I do that for two minutes. But you had to come up and sing. Yeah. Get chains, run up and sing, and then run back to you. So I ran to, to sing a song and then come back. Did yeah. you go on back, uh, back to work again? Yeah. I did, yes. yeah. Wait, it was wait. everything normal, you know, clients were just smiling and say, oh, we went to book for, you know, a boat trip. Oh, is that, <laughs> so what, you, is okay. that what you do during the day? Yeah. You work on the, on the, the, what do you call them, the, the ticket offices for the boats? Yes, cool. for the boats. So boat. I, thought, I thought, when he said, he said, oh, how long, when, when are we on? I'll have to go and get it. I'm like, wait, get, get who? The singer, she's working. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's, the, to me, that's brilliant because yeah. it just shows that, you know, it, as, as professional as it was, and as professional as you can be when you just have to do it, exactly. um, you've got other lives to lead. Because exactly. as a professional musician, which, and I say this point without any disrespect whatsoever, um, it's very hard to be a professional musician and you've all got other things to do. You're not just earning money from the musical thing at the minute because after 10 months you're, you're, you're waiting for, not waiting for your break I suppose, because you, I mean your break will come, um, but you've got other stuff to do so, you know, quick we're on! Okay. Yeah. <laughs> it was very good, actually. I mean, it was good. It was good we to like, see. It's we like this kind of the, of challenge because we also have done in another competition oh, yeah. three concerts in twenty five hours. Yeah, yeah. Three, three concerts. Twenty five hours. And one we went you, driving around the, the, the from from Ulule to Faro. In, in three one. concert in 25 uh, hours. Crazy days. Dedicated is what you are for, yeah, dedicated. Exactly. Hey, that's what we like to see. So who's your, on the, who would, um, as, as musicians, your, your, your Portuguese bass, do you do Portuguese music or do you just concentrate on English stuff? Well, that is a good question because we are a little bit obligated, you know, by the Portuguese people to write songs in Portuguese, you know. I because sort of understand you where you're coming from, know, yeah. but if, that, if your direction is English, Go English. Exactly. But that's what I think because otherwise, are you you're gonna make Portuguese music that doesn't sound really good, and you're just killing your album or you're just killing you know your general songs because of this Portuguese song. It's very difficult to include Portuguese words in a melody. I think absolutely. So you really, it's Rui Veloso is amazing on that. So we try to figure out what's the best. Uh, way to do, you know, Portuguese lyrics. But we, we obviously will do. We don't put Portuguese. aside the the but Portuguese songs. No, so if 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 if. I say this it and as to come, it comes yeah well that's what I mean you can do if, you, if you're yeah. doing a, yeah. a festival or a concert that needs Portuguese music you exactly. can sing the Portuguese music it's just for the direction that you need to go you'll probably find that English music will take you a different direction probably yeah. which will be better for you at the moment exactly yeah. I mean I, I can only speak about Portuguese music from the music I play because we're an English based radio station um, but my show I have to play certain Portuguese records now yes. again the, there's it's very hard to get some good ones there, is, there are some very very good ones yeah, there but there are also some that aren't that good yeah. But it's the same with English music. There's some great English bands, but there's some that aren't that good. Yeah. So who would you liken yourself to if you, if you were like anybody? I mean, do you, do you, do you picture any English bands and think, well, you know, that's what we... Because when I listen, you're not like the script. I mean, it's, it's weird because at the minute, in England, we don't have any bands that have got really good female singers. You've got Florence and the Machine yeah. with, uh, you know, a, a guy band, but with a lead singer that's female. There's not many. You don't see many bands with a, with a, a female singer. That's true. Um, someone told us we looked like runaway sort of. Who? Runaway. Sandra. It's, 
a German band, right? Yes, yes. one But they sing okay. English too. Big in Japan. Japan. Yeah. Big in Japan. So oh, check those out. Yeah. <laughs> I could picture that. I mean, yeah, I can see where that comes from. I mean, I don't yes. know the band themselves, but yeah, yeah, I can see you looking like a bit European. We are European. <laughs> <laughs> so it's um. You are going to go for a day up at uh, Mike Myers's Tin Man Studios. Oh yes. Do, do you know of Mike Myers? Well, yeah. Well, I've. He's massive. He's, he's, he's massive, incredible. Yes. We, yeah. so we, I went to the Facebook to look for his work, and he has this incredible classics. He's worked Amazing. with some unbel. He's worked with George Michael and yes. some unbelievable yeah. bands. Billy Ocean. Yeah. He's, I mean, these yeah. guys are these, and all these guys are like huge guys. Yeah. In, in the world of music, it's and he's amazing. done some really good stuff. I mean, you, you don't picture, you see Mike, and you think, oh, it's just Mike, it's Mike yeah. from Tim, but no, he's worked with everybody, yeah. and the studios are just fantastic. Yes. So you're gonna, you're gonna go in the studio, and is the idea to come out with a, like a, a CD of, or a, a, like four or five songs, or one track, or I don't know? Well, that would be, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> fingers crossed. Well, you, I, mean, exactly. I know you're going in to do a, a couple of tracks, but you, well, there's gonna be one that definitely comes on CD, because we're gonna play it on Kiss. That's the, that's the idea. Oh you see, we'll be, so I don't know what song you're thinking of doing. Thank you. But we're going to be playing it on Kiss. It's going to go on the Kiss playlist, and we'll, we'll just stick it on. So make it a good one. Make it song number three. Yes. I like that one. That I can yes. sing. Yes. <laughs> exactly. That's the one. Oh, he wants to sing. We he want wants to be singing back here. No, 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 the backing vocals. <laughs> <laughs> you can come for the back uh, vocals <laughs> when we are uh, recording. You want to be careful what you wish for, my friend, because <laughs> that may happen. Honestly. <laughs> Uh, right, so when you've been to Tim Man Studios, um, what what do you see yourself doing in the future? I mean, how how far do you want to take this? I mean, it, you tell me, how far is it going? Uh, how much? Uh, as far as, as many you can. as you as many as you think about it. I'm so afraid to think about it and do some, ex you know, be expecting so much. Because we it. achieved so much in such yeah. a uh, uh, short space short of time. Yeah. 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 That it's that incredible. No, I think it. we have to believe in everything, and we and we have to keep our score high and uh, think uh, beyond. I can well, I can honestly say um, that I mean I've, I've seen a lot of bands, and I've been in music a long, long time. I've, I've DJ for like 28, 29 years. I, I can always I have. As a DJ, you have a knack to choose good records. You have to be able to see what the crowd wants and what you know what you think is best for the time. Um, it's something I've been able to do for quite a while. Now, when I see a band, I can instantly see whether a band is good or bad. Now, for a band to come into a talent show on Kiss FM, singing their own things that they've written themselves, and win, and have me humming along by the end of the third song, which I didn't know, it means that you do have something a little bit special. And I do think you'll go quite quite far I don't know how I say quite far I mean I can't you know I mean Aurea is pushing herself out there or whatever and she's got a great single out now but I don't think she'll ever top the English market it's such a hard market to break but I think you'll do very well in what you're doing thank you and, uh, and I'm quite looking forward to the single that comes out Yay. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, so, Simon. Uh, that listen, will be dedicated for you, definitely. It's, well, that one. stick me on the stick me on the thing. Stick it's me on the album coming out. <laughs> Thanks to Sai, Kiss <laughs> FM. We love this guy. Uh, so, um, will you next year, if, if you're all still together as a band, will you come back and sing on next year's Kiss Have Got Talent as this year's champions? Yeah. We'll ask yeah. you back next year to sing, just like we, we, we had last year's winner this yes. year. So, will you yes, come back yes. and sing next year? Yes. Uh, yeah. man, that's brilliant. So, listen, um, I've got to go. I've got to hit the news. Right. Thanks for turning up. Thank right, you. Thanks for going out. Obrigado, amigo. <laughs> All the best for the for the future. I hope it goes really well. And I'm really looking forward to the single when it comes out. Thank you so much, Simon. Thank, Thank you. Blast the mask. Thank you very much indeed. Blast the mask. There. Winners of Kiss FM's talent show 2013. A big thanks to them, guys.